Let's create a dripping effect in Photoshop. Here we have the image of a girl. Let's first select this girl. So we will use the quick selection tool and here we have the option select subject. So once we got the selection, let's try to improve the selection first. So here we have the option select and mask. We'll click on it and uh, we can properly select her hair. In case uh, there is any background within the hair, we can uh, remove it. We can use this option refine edge brush tool. We can use this tool and we can just uh, properly fix her hair. We don't want uh, any background to show up uh, within these hairs. Right. And uh, make sure that here the view mode is uh, overlay. And then if we scroll down, we can see the option decontaminate colors. It will make the hair a little bit dark. So we can see some changes. And then we can select the option output to and uh, the option is new layer with layer mask. We can simply click OK. Right. And we can fine tune the hair if we missed any hair. So we can just create a layer below this uh, image layer and we can check if we properly selected the hair or not. The hair looks fine. Right. So now we will delete this uh, black background and uh, the next thing we'll be doing is we will just confirm the mask. We will select the mask thumbnail and We'll simply right click on the mask thumbnail and here we have the option apply layer mask right the next thing we are supposed to do is we will get this image here we have the image of a uh, dripping uh, liquid so what we'll be doing is we will first select the bottom portion of this image so we'll just uh, use the magic wand and uh, just click on the bottom portion, the white area. Now this white area of the image is selected. Now all we have to do is we'll simply drag this white area and uh, drop it over here. Drop it over this subject. Right. So we can see here. Right. Now the thing we'll be doing is we will be using this particular dripping uh, image as a mask. So for that we'll do one more thing. We will extend uh, this uh, image by using let's say laser tool. We will use the polygonal laser tool here. So we will just uh, create A selection that is uh, going to cover most of the dripping image right now we will fill this selection with the uh, pure white color so we will just hold control in PC or command in Mac and use the shortcut control backspace or command backspace so that we can now see there is a white color over here right now the thing we'll be doing is we'll simply hold control in PC or, or command in Mac and click on this layer thumbnail so now we can see a selection around this dripping image right then what we'll be doing is We'll keep the selection active and uh, select the image layer, the girl's image. And now we will just simply click mask icon at the bottom of the layer span. So we can see here and we will invert the mask. To invert the mask, we'll simply use control I in PC or command I in Mac. Right. Now we will simply hide the top layer. So we can see here and the next thing we'll be doing is we'll create a background behind this 
girl's image. So we can see here and uh, we will use the move tool and uh, keep this girl at the center. So we can see here. Right. Then we can do one more thing. We can actually confirm the mask. We can just right click on the mask thumbnail for this girl's layer and we will just select the option apply layer mask. That's it. So now we can see we got an interesting dripping effect in Photoshop. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Please do like, subscribe, share and if you have anything to say, do comment. See you again.